Hi friends, welcome to this video that is uh, update statement in Oracle. So using this update statement, we can edit the value of a row or more than one rows from an existing table. We will uh, see the example. So first of all, we will update all the rows for, uh, from an existing table. Here we can see the structure of our table. Describe table name is employees. Here we can see the structure of this uh, table employees. Uh, here we have these columns emp ID, emp name, emp DOB, emp salary, emp place, and emp PF. Also, so we will uh, see the data of this employees table. Select star from employees and here we can see the result when we observe this output here we can see the column mbpf it's not updated so we will update this mbpf uh, using this update statement here we can see the query for that we have to give update then we have to specify the table name it's employees then we are going to uh, set uh, mbpf equal to uh, we will give a uh, mp salary into 2 divided by 100 Here we can see this emp salary is a column uh, in this uh, employees table. Here we can see that. So we are going to uh, find the emp pf uh, using this uh, formula. Also here we can see we did not give the where clause. So that it's going to update all the rows uh, for this column emp pf in this table employees. Now it's time to uh, run this query. And here we can see four rows updated. That means uh, all rows are updated. Now we will view all the rows from our table employees. We will uh, run this query. And here we can see this column MBPF. It's updated. Now we are going to update a single row. Uh, using uh, update statement with the where clause. Uh, here I added two more rows uh, into this uh, table employees. Uh, here we can see with the emp ID 10 and 20. First of all, we will consider this row uh, with the emp ID 10. Here we can see the details. Here we can see this MBPF is not updated. Uh, here we are going to update this MBPF uh, for this MBID 10. Coming to our query, uh, here I am going to copy the previous uh, query what we given. Here is that. Here we have to uh, give the where clause. Where I am going to specify it's for emp id equal to 10. Here we are going to update this emp pf only for this emp id 10. We will run this query. And here we can see one row updated. Now we will view our table employees. We will run this query. And here we can see the result set. M by ID 10. Here we can see this M P of is updated. Now we will see one more method. That is update a single row with multiple columns. Coming to our table employees. So here we can see the last row. Uh, M by ID 20. Here we can see uh, two columns are null, that is MBDOB and MBPF. So we are going to update these two columns uh, for the MPID 20. We will copy this query and we will edit it. 
so update employees set here also we have to set mb pf uh, mb salary into uh, 2 divided by 100 then we have to update one more column that is uh, mb dob so we have we will uh, specify that here mb dob equal to then we will give a date in a single inverted comma we will give 0103 1993 any data then where mb id is equal to 20 so we are going to update for this row so here we have to give mb id as 20 now we will run our query here we can see one row updated now we will view all the rows from this table employees here we can see the result mb id 20 and we updated these two columns mb dob and mb pf well in this video we have seen how to update a table uh, that is a data manipulation language so friends if you have any doubt please comment below we will meet again with the next video thank you